The way in which you organize your project's folder structure and file naming conventions is very personal. This structure can vary greatly depending on how you like to work or what your project, client, or employer requires. Working within these structures can be tedious at times, but Anubis is able to help with part of the process. A powerful token system for automatically naming your exported video based on your own custom naming conventions is included with Anubis. It even allows you to create custom folder structures for your exports with the option to save to a folder relative to the AE project file so you'll always know where to find your videos. Simply click on this drop-down arrow to select from a list of the most commonly used naming components and begin building your naming convention. For a complete list of available tokens, follow the link in the description of this video. As you click on the token names, they'll be inserted into the file name field. I want my video to be named after the comp it came from, so I'll begin with the comp token. I'd like this file to be placed within a dated folder, so I'll add tokens for the year, month, and day, separated by dashes. And that's just a personal preference. You can use any type of valid separator that you'd like. To use these tokens as the name of a new folder, I'll simply cut and paste them at the start of the naming convention, and add a backslash to indicate a new folder. Next, I'll choose the directory I'd like this folder structure to be placed within. For this example, I'll use a global renders folder located on a secondary drive on my computer. When I click the Anubis button, my comp will be rendered and compressed, and the directory the video was saved in will open. The video is named after my comp, and placed within a dated folder inside the exported directory I chose. For further integration with an existing folder structure, you can use the parent folder token to instruct Anubis to navigate up the directory hierarchy by one folder. Combining this with exporting to a path relative to the After Effects project file enables you to work within an existing folder structure. For example, I'm using a folder structure where the After Effects project file lives within a folder named AE. The parent directory is a folder named Project Files, and that folder lives in the same directory as an Exports folder. I want Anubis to save to the Exports folder, so I need to check the Relative Path checkbox and add two parent folder tokens at the beginning of my file name, followed by Exports and a backslash. And again, I'll name the file after the comp name. Now Anubis will begin by navigating two folders up from the After Effects project files directory. Then it will look for or create a folder named Exports, and save my video file in that directory. Using this method allows your videos to always be saved exactly where you want them, maintaining the folder structure you're currently using. That's the power of naming tokens in Anubis. Check out help.battleaxe.co for more info, or click Learn Stuff inside the Anubis panel.